Have you ever wondered why we celebrate New Year's with such fervor and tradition? It's a universal phenomenon, but where did it all begin? From the loud cheers at the stroke of midnight to the joyous gatherings with loved ones, these customs have been shaped by centuries of history. We've all partaken in these celebrations, but have we ever stopped to ponder their origins? Let's embark on a journey through time to understand why we celebrate New Year's the way we do. The tradition of celebrating the New Year dates back nearly 4,000 years. Imagine this. While we might be popping champagne bottles and watching the ball drop, the ancient Babylonians were observing the first new moon following the vernal equinox, a day in late March with an equal amount of sunlight and darkness. This was their new year, a massive religious festival known as Akitu. They celebrated it with a different kind of fanfare, including a ritualistic victory of their sky god Marduk over the sea goddess Tiamat. Fast forward a few centuries and we find ourselves in the grandeur of ancient Rome. The Romans initially also marked the new year in March, but their calendar was continually tampered with by various emperors. It was Julius Caesar in 46 BC who introduced the Julian calendar. With this, the new year officially moved from the spring equinox to January 1st. Why January? Well, the month is named after Janus, the Roman god of doors and gates. Janus had two faces, one looking forward and one looking back. Caesar felt that the month named after this god would be the appropriate door to the year. In the Middle Ages, the Christian church, viewing these celebrations as pagan, abolished January 1st as the beginning of the new year. It wasn't until 1582, when Pope Gregory XIII implemented the Gregorian calendar, the one we use today, that January 1st was restored as New Year's Day. So, from the ancient Babylonians observing celestial events to the Romans honoring their gods, and through the twists and turns of the Middle Ages, the New Year has always been a time for people to celebrate and reflect. The date may have shifted, the traditions may have changed, but the essence of welcoming a new cycle of time has remained constant. Thus, despite the changing times and calendars, the tradition of New Year celebrations persisted. As the centuries rolled on, different cultures around the globe began to develop their unique New Year's traditions. A delightful potpourri of customs, each one as intriguing as the last, emerged from every corner of the world, adding to the global tapestry of New Year's celebrations. Let's take a virtual journey, shall we? We'll start in Spain, where the stroke of midnight isn't merely marked by the chime of a clock. No, in Spain, they have a tradition that's as delicious as it is symbolic the consumption of 12 grapes. That's right, as the clock strikes 12, each chime is met with a grape, each fruit symbolizing a month of good luck in the coming year. So as the Spaniards delight in their midnight feast, they're also securing a year of fortune. Now let's jet over to Scotland where the frosty air is filled with the warmth of Hogmanay. This Scottish New Year's celebration is steeped in ancient customs, the most famous among them being first footing. This tradition involves being the first person to cross a friend or neighbor's threshold after midnight, bearing gifts that symbolize prosperity, warmth, and good cheer. Quite a charming way to ring in the new year, don't you think? Our final stop on this whirlwind tour takes us to the land of the rising sun, Japan. Here, the new year is greeted not with loud fireworks, but with the reverberating sound of a bell. This Buddhist tradition, known as Joya no Kane, involves the ringing of a temple bell 108 times. Each toll is believed to cleanse the sins of the past year, leaving the soul refreshed and ready for the new year. It's truly fascinating to see the diversity in celebrations, isn't it? Each custom, each tradition is a testament to the rich tapestry of cultures that make up our world, each one offering a unique perspective on bidding the old year goodbye and welcoming the new. So as we move forward, let's carry with us the spirit of these traditions, a spirit of renewal, of joy, and of shared humanity. In the modern era, two traditions have become synonymous with New Year's Eve, the midnight kiss and the Times Square ball drop. As the year winds down and the clock ticks towards midnight, millions worldwide anticipate two special moments. The first is the midnight kiss, a tradition steeped in superstition and sentiment. It's believed that a kiss at the stroke of 12 will ensure affections and ties will continue throughout the next year. 
It's an endearing ritual, a moment of warmth and intimacy amidst the clamor and jubilation of the celebrations. It's a symbol of love and friendship, a promise of shared joy and companionship for the year to come. And if you happen to find yourself without a sweetheart when the clock strikes 12, worry not. A hug from a friend or a loved one works just as fine. The key here is to start the year with positivity and love. Now, let's journey across the Atlantic to the bustling city of New York. Here we find a tradition that's a little less personal but equally captivating. The Times Square Ball Drop. Since the year 1907, a specially designed ball has been lowered on a pole atop the one Times Square building, reaching the bottom precisely at midnight. This iconic event is watched by millions worldwide, a spectacle of lights and excitement that marks the transition to a new year. The ball itself, a dazzling mosaic of Waterford crystals, represents our collective hopes and dreams, descending to greet a new beginning. Over the years, the ball has evolved, growing more elaborate and luminous, a testament to human creativity and resilience. It's a symbol of unity, a shared moment of anticipation and celebration that transcends borders. In essence, these two traditions, the Midnight Kiss and the Times Square Ball Drop, beautifully encapsulate the spirit of New Year's Eve. They remind us of the importance of love, unity, and the promise of a fresh start. These traditions have become an integral part of our New Year's Eve celebrations, bringing people together in anticipation and celebration. Beyond the festivities and traditions, New Year's celebrations carry a deeper significance. The turning of the calendar from the old year to the new is not just a moment in time. It's a symbol of renewal and a chance to start afresh. As the final seconds of the year tick away, we find ourselves standing on the threshold of the future, poised to step into a brand new year filled with unexplored possibilities. New Year's celebrations offer us a moment to pause and reflect on the journey we've taken over the past 12 months. We think back on the triumphs and trials, the laughter and the tears, the unexpected surprises and the steady constants. This reflection allows us to appreciate the lessons we've learned, the growth we've experienced, and the resilience we've discovered within ourselves. But New Year's is also about looking forward, about setting our sights on the horizon and charting a course towards our hopes and dreams. The New Year stands before us like a blank canvas, ready to be painted with our aspirations and ambitions. It's a time when we make resolutions, setting goals and making plans to better ourselves and our lives. Whether it's eating healthier, learning a new skill, or spending more time with loved ones, these resolutions are a testament to our ability to change and grow. Moreover, New Year's celebrations foster a sense of unity and community. As fireworks light up the sky and glasses are raised in toast, we are reminded that we are part of a global community, all celebrating the arrival of the new year in our own unique ways. It's a shared experience that transcends borders and cultures, bringing us closer together in the joy of shared celebration. So as we count down the last moments of the year, let's embrace the significance of this moment. Let's reflect on our journey, set our intentions for the future, and remember the ties that bind us together. In the end, New Year's is all about hope, a fresh start, and the joy of shared celebration. So, why do we continue to celebrate New Year's with such enthusiasm and tradition? Well, as we've journeyed through the curious customs, historical origins and global traditions of New Year's celebrations, it's clear that this event is more than just a calendar milestone. Across continents and cultures, New Year's is a universal celebration that links us all, a thread of shared humanity woven through time. The historical origins of New Year's celebrations remind us that this tradition is steeped in centuries of culture, deeply rooted in ancient civilizations. From the Roman festivities honoring Janus to the Chinese Lunar New Year, these age-old customs echo through the years, resonating in our modern celebrations. The diverse traditions around the world, from the Spanish grape-eating custom to Japan's Joya no Kane, reflect our collective creativity and demonstrate the universal desire to mark the passage of time in meaningful ways. These rituals and customs, as varied as they are, speak to a shared human experience, an innate desire to celebrate, reflect, and look forward. 
The deeper significance of New Year's celebrations lies in its symbolism of hope and renewal. It's a time when we collectively hit the reset button, shedding the old and embracing the new with optimism. As we bid farewell to another year and welcome a new one, let's remember that at its heart, New Year's is a celebration of hope, renewal and shared humanity. Happy New Year's everyone, may your New Year be merry and bright. Ooh.